If you're thinking of starting your own vegetable garden, be careful when it comes to choosing the seeds. The Consumer Association of Penang has found vegetable seeds treated with neonicotinoids or fifth-generation insecticides. The treated seeds are coloured unlike the original seeds. Indian entomologist N. Selvam says research has shown that neonicotinoids poses danger to bees as it affects its neurotransmitter. The insecticide company is claiming it is very good effective against bad insects. But our very good friend of human being, the honeybee, honeybee is one of the beneficial insects. This also in the same ecosystem. If honeybees come and contact with this insecticide treated plants means, they are also get confused. They are not able to sense the floral uh, smell and they are not able to find out where the rich source of uh, flowers having honey and they are forgetting their way back to their home, particularly beehives. European Union banned this chemical from 2012 onwards. But all Southeast Asian countries, including India and Malaysia, they are using these treated chemicals for their uh, field purpose uh, without knowing the side effect of this chemical. Ecoscience Research Foundation of India Director Sultan Ahmed Ismail says what is worrying is farmers or consumers handling the seeds with their bare hands. You don't find any farmer in Asia either wearing a mask while spraying pesticide or wearing a gloves while using the seeds. And these are, according to entomologist Mr. Selvam, these are uh, very strong uh, neuro poisons. So we also know that most of the farmers keep smoking as they work. Mm -hmm. So very frequently when they are going to put their hands in the seeds and touch it to their mouth and to the lips, the transmission of these pesticides can go in. So gradually we are contaminating the soil as well with this fifth generation mm -hmm. insecticides. And uh, as the water comes in and leaches down, the water can also contaminate the groundwater. So the chain continues. It can even go into the food chain. It can even multiply in the food chain. The Directorate of Agriculture should take uh, initiatives to analyze, identify and then try to prevent the use of such chemicals or even if they are introduced in the market with the help of the Directorate, suitable warning should be issued to the farmers that the handle is safe. Especially with urban gardening now coming into four and even Malaysian's uh, de Department of Agriculture promoting urban farming and terrace farming, no home can be safe if they use urban gardening along with chemicals and pesticides. So it's high time that uh, lots of information reaches the public, that they use safe material like menu, traditional seeds and pest repellents. CAP has all the information and all the literature and even the Director of Agriculture has all the information. CAP also provides training for farmers and public on natural farming.